It's a big week for the Bismarck boys basketball team. With a pair of wins, the Demons could see themselves at the top of the WDA, a place for a team that is shattering offensive records that this school has never seen. Fresh off of scoring a school record 129 points on Saturday, the Demons come into this week with good energy at practice during a time of the season that head coach Jordan Wilhelm knows can bring a lack of focus. Sometimes these January grind, it can, it can get long and practices can get difficult, um, but the good teams are the ones that can truly come every day um, with their lunch pails and they're ready and they're putting their hard hats on and they want to compete. And um, I think our guys have shown that once they step on the court that they can block out the stuff going on away from the gym and really focus and get better. The WDA is about to hit the halfway point of the schedule. Teams that played once before playing each other again. I think uh, the first time through the whole conference is a nice little like look on each team. You get to know like how they play and how we play against them. So it's just nice to improve things on practice and look forward to the next matchup with them. Bismarck is averaging over 100 points per game. But it's not just because they have the top scorer in the state and Trace and Eagle staff. It's a team that believes that any guy that steps on the floor can score double digits. Our offense is like... It's kind of like, like you don't know who's going to get a bucket each night. Like you could have George go for 20, the next night Kyler goes for 20, and then like I can go for like, like 40. Like you never know. Like we all have like just like on and off nights, but no matter what, like someone's going to step up for us. Eagle Staff's goal this year is to be better at all-around offense, spreading the ball around instead of being a volume shooter. His coach feels he is blossoming under that newfound focus, which is leading the way to a historic season for the Demons. If they're going to guard Tracen with two or three guys, he needs to be willing to give it up, to stay active, to keep moving, and to trust his teammates that they're going to be able to go make plays too, which we've proven several games this year that we have a lot of different guys that can do it. So um, continuing to build that trust um, is huge for us, and I really feel like we're, we're heading in the right direction. And Bismarck will battle with a tough team defensively in Legacy tomorrow night before their big matchup on Friday night with number one Century.